Hello all coders, welcome to Refresh Coding. My name is Madhulika and in this video we are going to see how we can put this uh, Spring Boot project on Sonar Cube server by using the token. So first thing what you need to do is go to Sonar Cube official website here and go to download section and download the Sonar Cube in your system. So if you can see there is community developer enterprise many things are there but this community one is you can download for free so you can click here for download and the moment you will click here the download will start once it is downloaded just extract it at some location it will look something like this and then in this folder sonar cube folder go inside the bin folder inside bin folder just select this according to your operating system since I am using windows so I will open windows and start sonar so once you will click on start sonar it will look something like this means your sonar cube is up and operational so sonar cube server is running so sonar cube server runs on port 9000 so here what you will do you will just say localhost 9000 so I have already configured it so I have already uh, worked with this server already so it is coming in my system in your system first time it will ask for username and password so the username and password for sonar cube is admin admin so just log in with admin admin you can change that password so in the previous video we have seen how you can push this book service by using username and password from this uh, spring boot to sonar server but now we will use a token so first of all how to generate the token just go in administration general security and users and here go in tokens click here and now if you see i already have two tokens if you want to revoke a token you can revoke it just revoke it and generate a new token so let's say this one is now my token 1 and expires in 30 days that is fine if you want to change it you can change or else if you want to set no expiration that is also fine so i'll keep it 30 days and i will generate a token so if you see there is a new token which is generated for me i'll just copy this token and in the notepad i will keep it so if you can see uh, this is the command for login with token in your spring boot so i will just replace this token with the newly generated token and after this what you will do you will just copy this command this whole command you'll go to your sts and here you will just right click on your project run as maven build and give this command here in the goals section apply and run just save you need to wait for some time it will take some time and it will run all the things so if you see now here i am getting this build success it has run all these things and it is giving me analysis report and everything here if you see in my project i have already done the maven steps which is clean and install so this snapshot and jar is already generated after that you will run that command so it will do it will give you build success once it has given you build success you will just go to the server sonar server and in the project section you will check whether you got your project or not so here if you see we got this student service project as well so it will give you all the code quality and code coverage analysis okay code smells coverage everything so right now we are not getting anything here because i have not written any test cases for this project so if you will write test cases you will get the coverage whatever test cases whatever code coverage is there vulnerabilities bugs everything at every analysis you can do from here so that's it in this video Thank you and if you like the video please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much.